you have to respect it. If you don't like that, why don't you uh, form a consortium and buy the cloth from the crown case? Or else just shut up. You can still objectively, sometimes subjectively criticize Ateta, the crown case or Arsenal. I think you should. I prefer you do it objectively. I saw this video about Ligona. I have my reservations regarding him, but those are his opinions. But this opinion was just off the mark. Uh, let me play for you so you can know what I'm talking about. The trophies. We're not uh, progressing. We've yeah. gone back to the level we were seven years ago. Let's pause. He said we haven't progressed. We've gone back to the levels we were seven years ago. Uh, if I remember correctly, this is the first time in seven years we have qualified for the Champions League. Is that a progress or a regress? Let me know in the comment section. But he said we have not progressed. I'm not taking out of context. You heard him. This is not me clipping him up to take him out of context. No, he said we are not progressing. We've gone back to the level we were seven years ago. And seven years ago, we were not qualified for the Champions League. We have qualified for the Champions for the first time in seven years. We haven't made any progress. Hmm. Interesting. Look at our, our point tally. This is the highest we've had in seven years, but we haven't progressed. Is this making sense? Like I said, you might not like Ateta. You don't need to lie. Those, what he just said, those are not facts. But because he has a bigger following, and the fact that Terry, with the, I would say, the owner of Football Terry, did not push back enough. I'm not, I didn't say he didn't push back. He should have pushed back enough, but let's go into watch this. Very farcical, in my opinion. Yeah, when, so when you, we finish yeah, second have you, have, you, have you progressed under Arteta to a better level? No, it's took us backwards, so now it looks like progress. Terry, Terry, stop one second, mate, yeah? Right? <laughs> you, you can even see Terry's laughing in this part of the video. Arteta has taken us backwards. How? It's like I said, you might not like Arteta, but you don't need to lie. See, the facts doesn't support his opinion, because that's an opinion. That's not a fact. That's an opinion. Like I said, everybody's allowed to have an opinion. But for you to lie blatantly because you don't like the man, it's farcical. Let's watch again. How? He took us. He From took us. To second is backwards. What have we won? One FA Cup out of fourteen possible trophies he could have won. So you, you think about? So you think? So you think you're a worse team now than three seasons ago? I wouldn't say we're a worse team to watch. We're definitely better to watch. Yeah, but we still got the same culture at the club of loser when it matters. Yeah, let's pause. You, you see what he's trying to do? He wants to sneak in the BS over oh, a loser when it when it when it matters the most. I will agree to this. You see, see, people will sell you half truth, and if you are not careful, we are not logical enough, you will fall for the half truth. The half truth is that yes, we should have done better by not losing against our time team. Because I'm not going to be I'm not going to be I'm not going to overly protect our theta and the team. Would have done, should have done better against Liverpool. We should have surrendered those leads against West Ham, against Southampton. I get it. But in the grand scheme of things, we haven't gone backwards. Let's, let's be real. Nobody predicted that Arsenal were going to compete for the league at the beginning of the season. Nobody predicted. So, so for you to say we've gone backwards, it's a blatant lie. We have progressed under our tether. Look at the kind of players we bought, even without no Champions League. Look at, look at the beautiful football we are playing. I get it. You should have lost the lead, but Man City are a machine. They have a better squad. So let, let's stop it. Let's go to listen to this. It's appear when it matters, but apparently he's changed the culture. We're better to watch now. Yeah. And this season, and it's only this season that he's been here, it has been good to watch at times. Mm. But ultimately, he's come up short. Why? Because he ain't good enough, mate. Go and get someone that is good enough. And this is why I differ with most people. I understand that they're paying. So he's proposing we get rid of our tits and break somebody else. See, this is when I this is why I always say that fans and some of these content creators are doing the same thing, they are accused of the mainstream. Wrong with a destructive narrative. See, Lee Gunner, regardless of how negative he is, he is not stupid. If you think he believes what he's saying, you are an, you're an idiot. He is just writing on the emotionality of some of your fans who will see this and get overly triggered 
I say, yes, as I should have a better standard. As I should, no, no, no. How do you define standards? Within the context of the budget, within the context of our rebuild, Arteta has done well. Now, I'm not going to take away the fact that against Liverpool, West Ham, or Southampton, we should have done better. Against Everton, we should have lost a good same pack. I get it. But in the grand scheme of things, we, we, we've not done bad. And I blame, I blame the subscribers and the fans who actually idolize narratives like this. Because if you apply your, your common sense or your critical thinking, all just laid out with just blatant lies. I don't have anything against Legona or Terry, but we can't debunk these lies that is spreading. Blatant lies. Hey, disposable employees. We've got so, people out here saying get rid of Smith Road this summer. He's saying we should get rid of Arteta because we came second. We should get rid of Arteta and rip the project apart because we're second. Even though on paper, even before the start of the season, no fan was expecting us to compete. The highest we were hoping for was to qualify for the Champions League, maybe a Carling Cup here, maybe an FA Cup, maybe Europa League. I know we fell short in those other trophies, but in the league, we gave it all and we fell short. But that doesn't mean it's a disastrous season. We have brains to analyze these things and use, apply our common sense. Maybe I'm tripping. Let me know in the comment section what you think. Do you think Legona is right? Or you think I'm not tripping? If you're just stumbling into my content for the first time, like, like is the, the, the ticker is showing, like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Interesting.